Hey folks, and welcome to my brand new Let's Play of Marvel Ultimate Alliance Gold Edition! Yeah, this is the game that got me into the Marvel Universe. Well, that and the fact that I got curious about what the Sp Scarlet Spider was and re read about that. So yeah, this is one of the few good Marvel games that has multiple characters in it. Most of the new Marvel games only have one character in it, and I hate that. Now, I do have a saved game... It has a, the new Game Plus feature. I played through this game like 15 times trying to level my characters up to max, but we're gonna start a new game. Hold on a second. Shouldn't I be able to start on hard? Yeah, screw it. We're gonna start on easy. Wait a minute. What the hell is going on? Where's our air Better hit, let me keep all my stuff. Why aren't those rear batteries firing? Somebody get General Wilson on the horn! Colonel Fury. Doom. I'll have Oh yeah, and that's the white Colonel Fury. The better than the black one, in my opinion. Surrender your ship now, or I shall destroy The one who's portrayed by Samuel L. Jackson. This is a priority alert to all medics. I wouldn't wear too that much white. It's very easy to see in the dark. And here are our four starting characters. Spider-Man, draw them towards the stern. Sure thing. I just love being a target. Whoosh! You go it, Boy Scout. I don't take orders from you. I hate it when Wolverine's out of costume. I wish he would be in his costume all the time. That's his starting outfit, by the way. And there's Thor in his, uh, unique outfit. I'm not sure if he actually wore this in the comment comics. Soulless machine? How dare you strike and he has a different hammer, too. He doesn't have the stone hammer, he has a fancy hammer. There's Spider-Man. Sadly, not the superior Spider-Man, just the regular Spider-Man. The superior Spider-Man was awesome. And this was in the opening cutscene the title menu. Wasn't he supposed to draw them in closer? Oh, who cares? And there's Captain America. Who's, who currently now lost his powers and the Falcon has them now. And he's an old man. Could use some help. <laughs> That dude scares me. Yeah, I think he's awesome. And there's Logan now, climbing out of the wreckage. Completely unharmed due to his healing factor. What are you girls looking at? Your face, you hideous, stupid jackass. Wait a minute, this oh wait, this is a, because I'm... It's better let me choose my heroes. Wait a minute, it should have let me choose my heroes. What the hell is this? Alright, we'll just work this out as we go. Now, first off, uh... Let's see, uh, options. Let's turn off these annoying little hint things. I hate these so much. No? Yes, save these to the game profile. Don't jam the game, please. Thank you. And now this is the game. We can control four heroes as ones compared to one. So that's yeah, good. Yeah. As you wish. And we all have powers and stuff. It wouldn't be the superhero game without powers. And here are Ultron Warriors. Remember in the comics when Ultron made like 5,000 ridiculously weak copies of himself? I do. It was awesome. Why doesn't it, this building have a roof? That's very vulnerable to attack. Let's smash this control console in, in protest. You can also smash these windows in protest. Come on, Thor. Smash and smash and smash. This game has some nice music. Oh, oh no, I've been stunned because I've been hit by one of these 
storage barrels? These are some freaking huge storage barrels. Why is there a fan right here? That is very dangerous. If this vent got torn off, you'd fall to right down there. Shield throw! The only real impressive thing that, that Captain America can do. I think he used to have like a holographic shield thing that he could like throw endless numbers of those, but I think he didn't. Sadly, they didn't give him that. Guess you didn't want a piece of me. Ah, oh, my face! It's burning! Oh, never mind. Let's look over here. No, we can't go that way. Come on, you douchebags. Don't get caught on the terrain like you always do. So this is the Helicarrier. It looks nothing like it did in the comics, but it looks cooler than it did in the comics, so that's what matters. They apparently use old-fashioned flat guns instead of lasers and missiles, as you'd think they'd use. Ah, I'm Bardag! Uh. Oh yeah, and we can pick people up too and do stuff like that. Sorry about that. In the sequel, you can actually pick them up and walk around with them. Though you can't do that here. Man, who cares? The sequel is absolute bollocks. Where are you going? There, that's the wrong way. You have to go to, around this way, you douchebags. The AI isn't that great. And unfortunately, even though they're being AI controlled, they can still take damage and die, which is one of the biggest flaws of this game. Fortunately, it's not too common. And sometimes when you do combos, you hear some weird omnipotent being in the background saying fantastic and uh, heroic. Now these coins can be used to upgrade our statistics. Yeah, hang on, let's go. No, do not auto spend points. Immediately turn off the auto spend option. It's a piece of crap and I hate it. I like these. You son of a bitch. It didn't do something right. I'm going to have to quit and spend more time to fix this stupid thing. It should have kept my unlocked costumes at least. Jackass. Yeah, look, see, here's my save game data. Should I just start a new game like that? No. What the hell, man? Shut up, I want to skip this. Don't argue with me. It's supposed to give me an option to, like, select my heroes before, and they're supposed to have all their costumes just back at level one. Yeah, what the hell? Scary. That's bull, bull crap. Well, this is off to a banging start. Let's try a load a game. Maybe this will fix that bullcrap. Darn it! I mean, one thing, it's another! There's Invisible Woman. She's uh, kind of alright in this game, but... And here's my current team. Daredevil, Iceman, Miss Marvel, and Wolverine. What the hell was that? I think a bird flew into one of my windows. Oh god, this is going cr great. Come on, back to the time end. Don't you dare jam on me! Come on! Ah, here we go. Come on, let me use my costumes. Let me use my costumes, you jackass! Don't you dare jam on me! Oh, thank god. This it works now. We'll use default statistics. But we should still have all our costume, and we should be able to select our character at the beginning of this level. Yes, that's good. Now things are working. Well, I wasted like 15 minutes. Ah, oh, great. Now here's the guys we would normally play with, but we aren't going to play with these douchebags. We're going to play with Black Man. No auto! Oh god, I'm going to have to... Turn all this off again, aren't I? 
Not good, all their costumes are unlocked. And you also know, since this is the Gold Edition, I have additional characters, such as Cyclops, Magneto, Sabretooth, and Venom. And unfortunately, this is the only way you can... Switch to turn off the auto spend. No, don't auto equip gear either! Dear God, what is wrong with you people? Yeah, you better not auto equip anything or I must take your thumbs. I'm gonna have to spend an hour to turn off all this auto equipping crap. So we don't waste any of their points on their crap. It always invests them in the crappy powers. We don't want them in the crappy powers. So yeah, this is the only way you can get these characters because they took them off Xbox Live for some stupid ass reason. I never found out why. Probably copyright issues. It's bullcrap. They should have worked out a solution. Why did they take them away? They also had some DLC for the second game, but they took those off too, and there's absolutely no way you can get them. Damn it, Xbox Live or PSN Network. What the hell is wrong with you? I would have actually bought that for the second game. There's Storm. Bl another black hero. They should have a team about black heroes, yeah. <laughs> black power! 15% <laughs> uh, brutality or something. Uh, oh god, I'm gonna get so many bad comments about that. Uh, these stupid ass auto spend. Why would they do this? Seriously, if you make a third Marvel vs. Marvel Ultimate Alliance, don't bring back the auto spend option. It's bullcrap. There's Human Torch. Nice hairdo, moron. Yeah, the graphics, it, the textures in this game aren't that great. The second one had better textures, but it also was much crappier. There's Electra. She only appears here, and I was surprised they even bothered to put this minor character in here. Here's Iceman. Of the first X-Men and part of Spider-Man's Amazing Friends, a show that I watched when I was li little. Well, I only had a v VHS tape of it, so I couldn't watch. That was the only thing I watched, and they, but they did eventually put it on a. Let's see, what channel was it? Was it on Jetix? Here's Cyclops. <laughs> Here's Colonel Fury. We can unlock him as a playable character after beating the game. Nightcrawler. He's not that great. Deadpool. Didn't know who he was. He supposedly wears a, a rejected Spider-Man outfit. And Spider-Woman, who I originally thought was related to Spider-Man, but actually isn't. Let's turn off the... No, the gear option. Okay, I have turned off the stupid auto-spend for every character. Now we can actually start the game, and we're only 13 minutes in, so I can't get far. So we're gonna choose... Elect Minor woman no one cares about. Dead. Slapstick guy. And we got a bonus. 60% credit drops, because we're going to need those. I'm going to switch him to a different costume, though. Ah, health again. Yeah, we'll keep him with that costume. Uh, I guess we can keep her in that costume. Let's see, what do I normally like to keep him in? This was my favorite one. Don't everybody die this time? Oh, shut up, Deadpool. Okay, so now we're playing it with these douchebags. Now, normally there's a... You can have some unique uh, conversation options with characters you encounter, but... Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to get them all or not. Well, well, let's just play the game and we'll see. I'm dodging some lasers. They, the coolest of the black heroes. Alright, let's try this again. This time we're cooler and we're gonna get more money. Because we're assassins. Wolverine, where'd you go, you loose cannon? I'm gonna have you court-martialed for that.
Now this game actually follows a formula similar to X-Men Legends, but it performs better, because X-Men Legends was absolute bollocks, when you think about it. The first one. The AI damage takes so much damage, if you don't let make them use the health kits, they'll, they'll die. If you do make them use health kits, they'll use up all of them, and that douchebag just threw me into a frailing. That's nice. Guys, don't go into the fire! It's not good for you! Yeah, let's keep going. Slayer Strike! Oh, don't- I was doing my Slayer Strike! It's actually not one of Blade's better powers. His better powers is the machine gun and the spike of destruction. They only start with one power each. That's kind of crappy, but we'll level them up eventually. Yeah! Fantastic! Fantastical! Now, you actually noticed that one of my save files was on hard. That's because this is actually one of the few games I beat on hard. Just like Darkest of Days! Yeah, I think I had a dream about that game, actually. That's kind of weird. Yeah, and then we can do it! I got hit by a missile and somehow survived! Wow, Blade, your regenerative powers work good! Now, as you've probably figured out by now, the red bar above our portrait is our health, and the blue one is our energy. We don't have many good powers right now, so that energy bar is probably going to be full for quite some time. SMASH THESE PIPES! Yeah. Crap. Why are there so many of these around here? Are these like maintenance stations? Oh, and look over there in the upper left. Wonder who that is? Who's that Marvel villain? It's... He'll find out in a sec. The really crappy, a really crappy one who eventually becomes Venom, but he loses it and goes back to his crappy identity again. He was also in the Spider-Man the movie the video game, where you have to actually protect his ass, and it was frustrating as hell. Yeah, that game sucked. He said the second one was better, but I don't like those movie tie-ins. All oh, right, we got a level up. Means we can upgrade a power! No. We don't unlock this until level 5. Crap. What I needed. Yes, of course. Had someone been a hero? Looks like. And we all, uh. Now, when we press A, we actually stalk back or we're like, Scorpion, what are you doing here? I'm working for the biggest group of villains this world has ever known. The Masters of Evil! Which one's, uh, which iteration? There are like 15 of those in the comics. Let's try to... Is it Baron Zemo's? Baron Zemo's was cool. Who's in charge? Better be Baron Zemo, punk. <laughs> That's the best part of all. Oh, damn! Ah, oh, he's in everything! Why can't we have Baron Zemo in one of these? What's he want with this helicarrier? Tell me or I'm gonna bite you and drain your blood because I'm a black vampire. If you only knew. Talk, Scorpion, or you're gonna be in a world of pain. I'm gonna let Wolverine shove his claws up your ass. You wanna get to Alright, let's get now let's cut your ass. I'm gonna cut that stupid tail off. And our block move is ridiculously powerful in this game. It blocks virtually any attack. The only thing that Ooh, we all leveled up. The only thing it can't block is uh throw grabs. It's good because the roll move is rather difficult to use. Better luck next time, Scorpion. Come on, team, let's get to the bridge, because Colonel Fury Curry's wanna talk to us or something I don't know. I can't think of a joke because Leon 13's bad at thinking up jokes on the spot. That's my blade impression, it's not very good. Has anyone else unlocked abilities to use? Nope. Oh yeah, Wolverine has this special rage thing. When he get, get, gets raged, he unlocks more attacks. And we can pick up random debris and smack people with it. Blade's now known as Pipe. Open that. Here. Uh, get me, uh, you try to steal my pipe? Don't you t dare touch my pipe, bitch. Oh god, I'm gonna have to make another video before I can get to a save point. 
maybe. For quick, we might be able to get there before it. Oh, nope, it's 20. Now let's just keep going, who cares? And there's Thor going nuts with the thunder. They should really make a Marvel Ultimate Alliance where you play as the Dark Avengers, so you can play as like Ragnarok and Mac Dargan, Venom, Spider Man, man. Fury was the only guy standing up there in the cutscene. What the hell? Did that guy just run up there and was like, Oh, I'll save you, Colonel Fury, and he got flattened by a thing? No, I'm gonna be a dead bull. No problem, Colonel Fury! What's going on here? Looks like you got your asses kicked, even though you have, like, a powerful, like, war airship thing. Helicarrier's under attack by a group of supervillains called the Masters of Evil. Dr. Doom is back? Well, we did just hear that about that in, uh... From Scorpion, dude, but I'm gonna say it's that means back like I just learned this, so whoa! I thought exactly. what is, what's this doing? You're kinda far from home, aren't you? You're doing some illegal stuff? Not you better talk or I'm gonna stab my sword up your ass! Told you not whoa, chill out, bro! Oh, and there's Black Widow, the woman with no superpowers but inv advanced combat skills. Double's on its way, Black Widow. Team. Just one of We're on it, Colonel, if you'll pay us a bunch of credits, though. And we can talk to him again. Glad you made it to the party. Darn it, I wish Deadpool was... I thought Deadpool was gonna, like... If it'll help any way I can, Colonel, for a price, because I'm, I'm a greedy bastard. Started when radar detected distant Ghost images have some stealth technology. When they hit him, they thwarted every... Yeah, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, who cares? They're a group of supervillains. There's been sightings of tons of major criminals. I'd expect them. I still wish it was Baron Zemo. He's cool. My second in command, and that she's a former Soviet spy. It may be the modern day, but she's a Soviet spy or whatever. Yeah, who cares? We were hit pretty hard in the initial. Yes, to make we're near the limit. Carry yeah, whatever. Let's just get out of here. This is boring. Deadpool can do a teleportation thingy. Oh, good, a save point. Now we better. I have to be careful not to save over my original game in case a tornado hits my house and I lose this rare copy. Though I'd probably lose my Xbox too. So let's just save a new game. And when we come back, folks, uh, more Marvel stuff.